First and foremost thing, I would like to bring an attention of industrial control panels. Unlike many panels like motor control centers or power distribution equipment, industrial control panels pose a higher risk to the workers while performing a maintenance task. This is primarily due to two reasons. One is industrial control panels have multiple voltages available in them. For example, an industrial control panel can have a 480 volts or a 600 volts alongside a 24 volts control system or a PLC. For that reason, a person, for example, a maintenance person who is trying to make any tweaks to the process parameters, who doesn't need to even access any live or energized components, will be able to open that panel to just make tweaks to that specific section of the panel. But the problem is the inadvertent contact with energized parts when that specific individual opens the door of the cabinet, right? Unlike your MCC, you know that it's only qualified person who is performing the task. Here, it could be a machine operator or a control programmer who is performing the task. By providing a panel interface connector like gray sport, it will greatly minimize the risk of exposure of opening that specific cabinet. So a control programmer or a maintenance person can safely hook up their PLC or a computer to these programming ports and safely perform those programming functions from outside the cabinet while the system is still energized and not opening the door. Again, this meets the article 110.4D as defined in normal operation criteria where everything is closed, they're not accessing any energized components. And one more thing you asked about is the GFCI, which is a ground fault circuit interrupter. This is very important with the industrial control panels because it is not like a nice to have feature anymore, it is a must have. If you look at NFPA 79, which is a standard for industrial control, industrial machinery, and also UL 508A for industrial control panels, they call it very clearly any type of receptacle that's mounted outside the enclosure or a control panel must be a GFCA protected. If you use anything that's inside it, then UL 508A doesn't require that to be GFCA protected, but anything that's used for accessory equipment that needs to be GFCI protected. So by using a GRACE uh, panel interface connectors, one can safely meet the requirements of 508A and also NFPA 79 and further uh, enhance their worker safety and productivity as well.